It's Saturday, and we're still doing stuff with the tiny house that I have not moved into yet. Um, so today we're skirting. We're putting the pieces um, that will go around all the bottom to provide a bit of extra insulation and protection and um, weathering um, for the tiny house. So hopefully nothing freezes over the winter, keeps critters out, etc. So we've got half of it done. I'll just bring it around the back side. There's the back. We still need to level out gravel and all that kind of stuff. Make it uh, a little bit more appealing. Uh, there are holes in the uh, skirts here, Rach. That's where those back ones go. And we've got this side completed. Above the, or in front of the wheels. And all the way to the front. We'll need to put the front side on when we get the other side finished. And all the way along here. So we're halfway done and uh, we should be getting better at it. We'll see. Uh, so I've got the other camera going so you'll be able to actually see what we're up to uh, as we're doing it and uh, yeah, a lovely day, uh, bright and sunny. A uh, few, few minor clouds in the sky, but uh, it's probably about, what, five degrees or so? Something like that. Hey Google, what temperature is it? Five degrees. All right, uh, so let's get to it. All right, it's uh, later after Saturday afternoon, and uh, we've got the skirting in place uh, all the way around, including this back corner and that back corner and the front side. We're going to have to do some moving of the gravel and all that kind of stuff get it in place. Um, I'm just working on getting the last corners in. So this one and this one. Not sure exactly how I'm going to do that. Um, so we've got two corners. And technically they fit over top here but they certainly don't fit close or tight. 
I don't know exactly how that's going to be finished. But we'll work something out. And that one's the same, same issue. This one I think fits a little bit better into the corner. But to have that, and on Monday, the person with the combi boiler, or the the uh, person who knows how to fix the combi boiler, is supposed to be in. And that'll be the last step on this installation. Anyways, we'll take you along for the ride uh, to see how we're finishing this. And talk to you soon. Okay, it's end of the day. I don't know if you can see her, but Trish is up there uh, seeding away. She's uh, seeding pool today, uh, putting down clover in the open uh, uh, dirt areas. We're just finishing up raking gravel up to the skirt. We're finished. So we got this corner finished and the skirt across the front. And this corner is finished as well. And the skirt along the side. Put the power and the cable in, uh, internet cable, fiber. Um, all the skirting is covered here along the side. back and up to the door stairs in place and we have a little bit of of uh, wood chips to lay down yet uh, to take the path to the uh, back of the garage there and I want to put there's um on the the front half of the pile there's cedar chips, so I think I'm going to do, not a layer, but top, top, top coat of that, yeah. It seems to be bigger chips too, which I think will be good. So yeah. we'll do the full path, see how far we get, and then go from there. Any last words, Trish? No. Satisfying day? Yeah, I think I got all the clover down that I want to get down. Is Anyways. it actually going to do with something? I don't know. <laughs> hopefully it'll uh, it's like a ground cover now. It'll so, sprout in you know, the spring. Yeah, especially in the in where there's no weeds now. At least there'll be something down yeah. before the weeds take over. Um, <clears throat> and hopefully we can do something about all of the stuff over the septic bed there in the spring sometime. Because I'll be after something. Mm -hmm. so. A frog went under the, the tiny house. Just as we were like shoveling in that part, it sneaked through like the rubber thing. I was like, but you're going to die now. <laughs> Shucks. Okay, I, I think we're going to leave it there. So I'll leave you with a shot of the so sunset over the shed like, and the purple kind of in the background. I'm gonna watch it though. These are yeah. the kinds of sites that we do see different. on occasion. Uh, we will be 
uh, cleaning up the downed trees. So that one, there's another one there, and there's a few in the back corner. And there's that one over there, past the corner of the tiny house. So we'll clean that stuff up during the winter when we can get a hold of a chainsaw. Look at the colors. Yeah, you got a beautiful... Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It never looks as good on camera. No, I know. Yeah, the colors just kind of go, go away. There's some orange. Yeah. But the purples disappear. Yeah. Okay. Until the next one. We'll see you soon.